Hello everyone, this is Just a Dad. Today I'm going to show you how to descale this Cuisinart SS10 single serve coffee maker. So this is a coffee maker that uses K-cups. The first thing we're going to do is we need some white vinegar. So it says we need 20 ounces of white vinegar. I buy it. I buy the 64 fluid ounces. This is a buck 50 at Walmart. The next thing we're going to do is make sure we don't have a K-cup in here. So lift the lever, put the lid down. Okay, you can empty the, the reservoir out, and then I would take my carbon water filter out. We don't want to run vinegar through that, so we're going to take the carbon water filter out and just set it to the side. So here's what the instructions say. We're going to put 20 ounces of white vinegar and 40 ounces of water. Then we're going to press and hold the hot water and rinse buttons to start it, and then we've got to rinse it thoroughly. So you also need to do this if your descale light comes on. And you could do some damage to the coffee maker if you don't descale it. That, this thing will sense if that heating element inside is starting to get covered with hard water deposits. So if your descale light comes on, uh, make sure you do this. So I've got my measuring cup. I'm going to pour the vinegar in 20 ounces. So this only goes to 16, so I'll do 16 and 4. And then we just pour it right into the water reservoir. Okay, so I've got my 20 ounces in. If you don't have a measuring cup, it's just right above the, the minimum fill. So if you fill it up to about there. And then we're going to put... Um, now I'm going to put 40 ounces of water in here. And I'll show you where that ends up being too. Okay, so I've added my water and it's, it's about this location on the reservoir if you don't have a measuring cup. So you're going to add water up to just about there, which is below the max fill. So make, you have, make sure you have like a large container to empty it in because it is going to uh, brew a lot of, of that hot water and vinegar through here at one time. Okay, so here we are at the control head. It says open the head. So we've got to open this to activate it. Now these lights are flashing and we're going to press these buttons at the same time. Okay, so I make sure you press them at the same time. I wasn't able to, so you gotta kinda really grab it. There, now it's at the same time. I pressed them at the same time, they're both lit, and now it's gonna brew that vinegar and water through there. So here it is, I got my large container. Both those lights are lit. It's brewing the, it's doing a descaling operation, brewing the water and vinegar through there. Okay, so that took about two minutes and it, it runs about 14 ounces through when you press those two buttons at the same time. Now we got to keep doing that until this water reservoir goes down. Okay, so I dumped the water out. I, so I had to lift the head again in order to, to activate the control panel. Now I'm gonna do the same thing again. Press these at the same, there. I got to keep doing that, that process of lifting the head, pressing those two buttons, until the add water light comes on, which is gonna bring the water reservoir down pretty low. Once that's done, we're gonna clean out the water reservoir and run some fresh water through. Okay, so my add water light's on. That took about four times of doing that. About 15 minutes to run all that water through. Now I'm gonna take this over the sink. I'm gonna clean this out with soap and water, and I'm gonna fill it up with uh, fresh water. Okay, so I got my reservoir filled with water. It's all cleaned out. Now we got to do something a little different. We're going to do hot water brews. So I'm going to lift the head to activate it, make sure there's nothing there. I want to select the largest size. I'm going to come up here and select 12 ounce, and I'm just going to hit the hot water button. So now it's going to brew that hot water. And what this is going to do, this is going to, this is going to flush out that white vinegar that's inside the machine. And we're going to keep doing that same process of brewing a hot water. Remember, you have to lift the head to activate it again until that that water reservoir is completely empty okay so start to finish this process is going to take you about a half hour to 45 minutes your clean or your descale light should go away if it doesn't you may have to do the whole process uh, again with the white vinegar so again this is just a dad i hope this video helps um, i check my comments daily if you got any questions about how i did this or anything about this coffee maker please leave your comments below 
I've got a detailed review on, I brewed uh, some K-cups and some coffee grounds through this, if you could check that video out too. So again, if you could, please like and subscribe, and thank you for watching.